Hello everyone. Introducing NIO Cutting Edge Battery Sharing Initiative, transforming ownership dynamics with seamless battery swaps and rentals, offering unparalleled flexibility. NIO has now launched a revolutionary new battery sharing program. Up until now, we all knew that with NIO, you could upgrade your battery pack, and the size of the battery pack you purchased with your car wasn't limited to any extent. You can upgrade from a standard range of 75 kilowatt hours to 100 kilowatt hours either permanently or on a temporary rental basis. In fact, in the next few days, on Sunday to be precise, I'll be upgrading my battery pack rental for two days. Isn't that absolutely crazy? But it's a whole new level, right? That's what NIO is doing with this battery sharing program. Now with battery upgrades, I have to pay NIO for that battery upgrade or rental. That battery belongs to NIO. But with the battery sharing program, if I have a friend who has a 100 kilowatt hour battery pack and let's say my friend, let's say he really doesn't need that battery pack. He's okay with the 75 kilowatt hour battery pack. Or I strike a deal with him and he gives me that 100 kilowatt hour battery pack. Through your platform, you can do this and then drive your NIO, the one your friend operates. Your friend takes the NIO to the swap station and swaps it for 75, puts in 100 at the swap station, and then you can go to the swap station and take 100 in your car, actually their 100 kilowatt hour battery pack, which you can use for as many days as you want. And they also receive some compensation in NIO points and NIO value points. Now, these are significant impacts for NIO in the future of the robotaxi business because if you have any NIO with you, it can share with any battery pack you have and with permission, you can use any size of battery pack with your friends. And we know that NIO can already swap by itself, basically. And in that respect, some NIO is ahead of Tesla when it comes to charging the car, putting power in the car, you know, with Tesla. You still have to tell someone to plug the car manually while NIO can drive itself to the swap station and back. But with this battery sharing thing, it depends on what kind of robo-taxi journey you want to take. If it's a long journey, they can essentially swap into a 100 kilowatt hour battery pack and then go, and then you'll have to take that robo-taxi, and if there's not much distance to cover, just swap in 75, or if it's a long distance journey, then swap in 150. According to the range of the trip, you can use the battery pack you need, understand. Elon Musk says that in the future, Tesla owners can become financial moguls for their Tesla cars and can run the robotaxi or robotaxi ride-hailing business for themselves. And this is something that greatly increases their value. But here NIO has already done everything beforehand. You can drive your car without any assistance, obtain assistance through battery swapping, and can also decide for yourself which battery pack should be used for longer journeys, perhaps. Both of these tasks Tesla cannot do at all. It is absolutely impossible for Tesla to charge itself without human assistance beforehand. You need robotic hands, which very few people have. If they have them, they are in Tesla labs and such places. And if you want to upgrade the battery pack, there is no chance to upgrade the battery pack on Tesla, especially with a structural battery pack. Pray for success. You'll have to upgrade the entire structure. You'll have to separate the structure. Battery swapping has its own advantages. It's a big win for NIO. So, indeed, for fleet management of cars, for example, with 23 NIO with NIO owners, because there are so many NIO, he can start his own robo-taxi business, making it, and he won't need to buy large capacity batteries. He'll only need one. And basically, in the future, you can send them for robotaxis, and whichever car needs to go further, you can switch it to that car. Basically, this means you don't need to remove the battery pack. Taking a battery pack on rent from NIO when you're upgrading for long trips, especially for those who have a lot of NIO. So, for example, 23 NIO owners have a lot of NIO. Most of them have a standard range battery pack of 75, but they have one or two that are 100. They always wanted this possibility, this option to put 100 on any car because their battery is theirs. What difference does it make if it's on ET7 or ES8 or ET5? I mean, it's all their battery, right? 
So now they have this flexibility. And with this, you can absolutely put whichever NIO you want, that battery pack, the long range battery pack, and on whichever NIO you intend to travel with, put it on that too. And what's really amazing is that with the upcoming 150 battery pack, basically, you can just buy it or tell a friend to buy it, and then if needed, you can just borrow it from your friend, which is quite strange too. So far, the biggest hurdle has been insurance. It seems that insurance is a bit complicated when it comes to things like buying insurance for a 75 kilowatt hour battery pack. But now you have a 100 kilowatt hour battery. And for some reason, if you happen to have an accident, the cost of the battery is higher. But it seems that NIO has solved everything, which is absolutely fantastic. Now, what's even more interesting is that you can start your own battery upgrade program. Meaning, if I have a 100 kilowatt hour or 150 kilowatt hour battery pack, and I want to rent it out to my friends so that they don't have to face NIO rental upgrade fees, they'll just give me the money, and maybe I can give it to them at a lower price than NIO, and they'll get my battery pack. Or I can do this for free, and then they can use my battery pack and repay me as a favor. Now you may ask, can I borrow your battery? This is quite troublesome. Have you ever heard of this in terms of EVs? Like, you never even think about it. Can I borrow your battery? Can I borrow your long-range battery pack for a few days? This just happened, which is pretty crazy, NIO. No doubt, NIO is doing some next-level work in terms of charging batteries and battery replenishment swapping, and all that kind of stuff. NIO is doing some next-level work there, my friend. So I would say NIO is close to Tesla fully autonomous robotaxi fleet. You have robotaxis, but still, you need to charge someone and do everything. But I think NIO is really close. There are rumors that NIO already has L3 certification, but they are keeping it under wraps but I definitely don't know if those rumors are true or not. Maybe they are true. This is quite weird. Borrow it. Let me borrow your battery pack. Now you can officially say this. Give me your 50 kilowatt hour battery pack. How crazy is that? Only with NIO. NIO launches innovative battery sharing, allowing flexible upgrades and swaps, pioneering autonomous fleet management, redefining EV dynamics with NIO advancements. Thank you for joining us today. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more stock predictions and market insights. Remember to turn on the notification bell so you never miss an update. Happy investing and see you in the next video.